Hi, my name is Florian from Quality Guru, where I answer your questions and share knowledge about quality management. Today I want to talk about the production quality engineer. The production quality engineer is a very important role, especially in manufacturing companies. Companies which are producing products and shipping them to other companies or to the final end user of the product in the market. So what is the job of the production quality engineer? First of all, it's to monitor the production operation and ensuring that all the output of this production process is meeting the customer requirements or the quality requirements. Could be from the customer, could be internally from the organization towards themselves, or could be from the government, some legal requirements in this country for this particular product. And how can the quality engineer do that? And there's a tool for this, which is called the production control plan. The production control plan will list all the different production steps which the process, the product has to go through in order to be produced. So there can be many production steps and for each production step, the control plan will define what is the risk for the quality of the product in this particular production step and how we can ensure that we detect any deviation to the quality standard in this particular step and how often we should check. So for example, it could say that in step one, there's this particular risk and I should do a certain inspection, maybe with my eyes visually inspecting, or I need to use a test equipment to put my product, uh, product inside and measure it in a certain way. And I should do this with a certain frequency maybe every piece, so 100%, maybe every one hour, every shift, every week, every day, every month, whatever is necessary to ensure the quality of the product is defined in the production control plan. And it's also saying what you do when you find a defect. So you do the inspection with the right frequency and when you find this, a, a defect, what should be the reaction? And here one of the reactions for the quality engineer, very important, is to gather the data, but then also together with the team, analyze the problem and stop it as soon as possible. So here in this problem solving process, the engineer is using problem solving tools like 8D Report, Ishikawa, 5Y, Six Sigma, Shining, all kinds of different quality tools in order to get to the root cause and fix it as soon as possible. Why? In order to avoid affectation of the production, affectation of the customer and financial impacts for the company itself. Once a problem is solved and identified and stopped, the engineer should also do a process called lessons learned. That means how can I do now with this learning from this product, what do I have to do differently in the future maybe also in other projects and other production lines in order to avoid that I don't have the same problem again. And here I can use, for example, tools like the FMEA. The, I can update my control plan because obviously what I did before was not good enough in order to avoid this problem. So I need to update my all my quality system in a way to prevent that this kind of failure is happening again. And when I monitor my data and I see uh, what are my basic problems and I solve them step by step, then in theory, the production quality should be better and better and better. And we should be on a path of continuous improvement driven by the production quality engineer together with the whole factory team step by step. Let me know what you know about production quality engineers. Are you a production quality engineer? Is this what you are doing, what I describe, or do you have a different opinion? Let me know in the comments. Looking forward to reading about it and see you in the next video.